There are two types of people in this world. Those who recline their seats on airplanes and those who don't. It is basically the Montagues and the Capulets, but in the sky. Wow, you guys, that is a really good idea. Anyways, the problem has escalated recently with three mid-air flights over seat reclining in one week. This most likely stems from the ever-shrinking amount of legroom in coach. Just one of the many terrible changes airlines have made. But there are some changes proposed that might make flying better. Glass bottom. Virgin Airlines has announced that it's going to produce the world's first glass bottom plane. Passengers will be able to look through the aisle straight down to the earth below. This actually is really only going to make your flight better if you're not afraid of flying, like me. If you are afraid of flying, this is like a nightmare wrapped in a bad acid trip. Child free zone. Malaysian Airlines and Air Asia have both started kid-free zones on their flights. And on Singapore's Scoot Airlines, children under 12 are banned from certain seating areas and put behind a curtain. Abu Dhabi's airline is also making an adjustment for flying children. They introduced in-flight child experts to help calm and distract. If I may propose one solution to help with kids on airplanes, onboard petting zoo. What could go wrong? Standing room. An aerospace engineering professor suggested adding standing room only seats to flights. His study suggests that by adding this option, it could drop ticket prices by 44%. Europe's Ryanair once flirted with the idea, but has since moved on. I got a better idea, guys. Bunk beds, just stack us. I don't mind, who would mind? Do it. Meet and seat. KLM Airlines is letting you pick your seats based on who's on your flight. When you buy your ticket, passengers are able to link it to their Facebook, Google+, or LinkedIn. Then browse the other passengers, and if you see one you like, choose a seat next to them. Your flight time can be used to network for business, spend chatting about shared hobbies, or most likely be some creep that saw your picture on Facebook and keeps dropping mile-high hints. Gross. If you guys are interested in understanding more about current events that may be filling up your Facebook or Twitter feeds, check out TestTube. They cover everything from war to religion to gun control. So what's the deal? Are Bill and Melinda Gates trying to take your guns? Well, I can't speak for Bill and Melinda Gates, but as for this initiative... Or if you want to know more awesome things in the air, watch our episode on First Class Perks. What airline changes would you make to make flying more enjoyable? Be sure to let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. There are motherfucking lambs on this motherfucking plane.